Hit by two prolonged spells of heat waves, eastern India has just seen its warmest April since 1901. Now, this is what the Indian Meteorological Department has confirmed today, even as searing heat wave conditions sweep major parts of the country. Now, we know that Odisha and West Bengal have been simmering under these heat wave conditions for the past 15 days. In fact, the number of heat wave days in West Bengal have been the highest since 2010. Apart from that, several other states, starting from Bihar, Jharkhand, Chhattisgarh to Tamil Nadu, Kerala, Konkan and Goa, Gujarat, as well as Karnataka, have witnessed heat wave days all through April. The entire month saw two spells of heat waves, one around 15. 5th to 7th April, the second started around 15th of April. Now, the latest forecast of the Indian Meteorological Department suggests that this intense heat is also expanding to other parts of the country. So, North West India, now here I'm talking about states like Punjab, Haryana, Delhi, Chandigarh and parts of Uttar Pradesh which did not witness any heat wave days this April could also experience heat wave days in May. Normally, the heat wave days are usually around 1 to 3, but this time the weather department predicts that the number could go up to 5 to 7. And this could be higher up for other states which are Gujarat, Rajasthan and the other southern peninsula states. Now, overall, the monthly uh, uh, average temperatures are likely to be above normal. The IMD chief, Dr. M. Mahopatra, also expressed his concerns that it's not just the day temperatures, but the night temperatures are also surging, which is adding to a lot of heat stress for the people. The weather department is, has also been issuing these hot and humid warnings for states like Kerala, Konkan and Goa because the humidity has also surged to uh, alarming levels in certain places. Now, there could be some intermittent relief because of the thunderstorms, but overall, it's going to be one scorching summer. Now, May is the time when summer hit its peak and that is the time when we can expect intense uh, heat wave conditions. Now, all this, uh, uh, you know, these heat wave conditions are coinciding with the seven phase long Lok Sabha elections. Now, the polling started on April 19th and it will continue till June 1st. So, the left, uh, the, the five phases will happen during May, uh, which is when the northern states also, including uh, Punjab, Haryana, Uttar Pradesh would also go to uh, go for polls. And the Election Commission of India has also issued advisories and so are the experts advising people to take adequate precautions, drink enough water, avoid sun exposure from 12 noon to 3 p.m. and uh, protect yourself from these intense scorching temperatures.